Welcome to Inside the Huddle. I'm Mike Joseph for the Lafayette Sports Network and GoLeopards.com. The Leopards return home this weekend against their first Ivy League opponent of the year, the Princeton Tigers. This has been a great rivalry over the last couple of years. Very close games. Lafayette's gone down by less than a touchdown in both games, and it's really come down to the last possession. What I'm going to talk about today for Princeton and the Lafayette defense and even the Lafayette offense is what I call staying on schedule. These are the most important things for an offense, whether it be Princeton or whether it be Lafayette. When you look at a uh, uh, coach holding his play sheet, I'll show you a play sheet, just holding his play sheet, usually they have it up to their mouth like this. So what they're doing really is kind of disguising what they're saying, not allowing people to see what they're saying, and they're trying to read off their schedule, and they look at first and ten plays. These are the most important plays, and these are the plays I think Lafayette's defense has to try to keep Princeton's offense that's going to run multiple sets. So you're going to see a tight end. You're going to see double wide receivers. You might see five wide receivers. You may see a tight end and two backs in the backfield. You may see two different quarterbacks in the game at the same time. So they are multiple everywhere, but first and 10, having somebody break into the backfield, make a play into the backfield, whether it's an end, a tackle, bringing pressure up the middle, bringing pressure off the edge, on first and 10. The first play against Villanova, six yard loss, a tackle by Jerry Poe. So, First and 10 is going to be the most important down, I think, for both offenses in this game. Second and seven, this is the way a coach breaks it down. Second and seven plus, second and four to six, second and one to two. Those are situations where coaches have calls on their sheet to make calls to get the first down or move the ball forward. Also, third and seven plus, third and four to six. So be a coach with me and take a look. First and 10, a big play, getting people behind the sticks. You want to get them into second and seven plus or third and seven plus. So plays that are on schedule, second and one to two, you and I can both call that play right from the sideline. Four to six on schedule. So you want to make sure you pick up at least four, to four yards or three yards on first down. And on second down, you want to bring up those third and one or third and four to six. High percentage, I always talk about staying on schedule and manageable downs for a freshman quarterback for Lafayette and Chad Kanoff, who had a little bit of trouble last year against the Lafayette offense. This is going to be a great game. I think a high-scoring game, a chance for John Garrett to get his first win against his old school.